It's week six NFL Sunday, and I've got your free play on the Cowboys at the Patriots. Use the promo code NHL to save yourself 20% off of the entire site. My name's Allie Burns from Picks and Parlays, and I've got Dan Kaiser, expert handicapper from Picks and Parlays, with me today. What's happening, Dan? Uh, not much, not much. Uh, just coming off a 3-0 uh, Sunday in, in the NFL and 13-6 in the, in the Major League uh, Baseball playoffs so far, so... And those two sports, everything's looking great. I love it. You have been crushing some baseball lately. I got my eye on you. I know what you're up to over there. So we've got the Cowboys at the Patriots. The boys are the favorite, minus three and a half. They are five and oh against the spread this season, I believe, um, which is really impressive. Total on this one's 51. What you play, Dan? Well, right now, all you, all you can say so far this season for Dallas is, how about them Cowboys? I mean, they're four and one. They're coming off a 44 and 20 beating of, of the New York Giants. Right now, it's the, the NFC East is theirs to lose. I mean, the, right now, the, the offense, I mean, you can't ask for much more. Dak Prescott's throwing 13 touchdowns, his three interceptions. He's playing a really good football. They have a two headed two headed rushing attack with a, uh, Ezekiel Elliott and a Tony Pollard. Elliott has 452 rushing yards, five touchdowns. Pollard has a little over 300 uh, and 25 rushing yards. And, and that really is uh, a factor for them this year. This running game allows them to open up uh, the passing lanes and CD, CD Lamb and Amari Cooper. You know, if those guys can get open and that can find them, you know, only, only good things can happen. Uh, the Patriots are coming off a very ugly 25-22 win over Houston. You know, Mac Jones... Some days he looks great, and some days he looks like the rookie he is. He's five touchdowns, five interceptions. Damian Harris uh, leads the rushing attack, 230 yards. And, I, again, this is basically the same thing of the, the Patriots of old. You know, you're in trouble when you're leading receivers, a guy named Jacoby Myers. I mean, it just goes to show that the Patriots still haven't figured out how to get uh, talent on the outside for their quarterbacks. You know, it was the same thing when Brady was there. At least Brady could do something with lesser talent. And, you know, Jones isn't bad, but he's not, you know, obviously he's not Brady. The, the Patriots defense has stepped up. You know, they just released the stuff on Gilmore. So they, I was expecting him to be back and, and add into this defense. But, you know, their defense has stepped up, but they do give up some points. They gave up 22 to a bad Texans team. So I think Dallas is going to score and a ton in this game. The Patriots have have shown that they can score points, so uh, I think fifty one's a little bit low, low number in this one. So I'm taking the over. Taking it over. All right. Yeah, I'm kind of like weary of the side on this one because the Cowboys do look so hot. But like, when are the wheels going to fall off? And I can't say that I'm surprised. I think everybody was surprised last season when they were really bad. I'm not that surprised. It's like all the parts came together for that team. And it, it really just revolves around that offense. So I'm with you, Dan. Let's roll with an over 51 points here. Cowboys at the Patriots. Dan, what do you have loaded up over at picksandparlays.net for this weekend? Well, obviously, it's going to be uh, a lot of baseball, since uh, that's one thing that's going good right now. Uh, I'll have uh, uh, hockey. I, I'm taking it easy in hockey. I'm not playing a lot, uh, only because it's early in the season. I want to get a feel of it. College football will be a big card on Saturday and Sunday. Uh, we'll just see. We'll see how it goes on Saturday. If I got a good feeling after Saturday, I'll play heavy, heavy Sunday. And if it's just a average day on a Saturday, then I'll just put up, you know what, my three best plays for Sunday and, and, and ride with those and see what happens. That's smart. It's important to manage your bankroll. You know, you have an average Saturday. Don't try to chase and get a whole bunch on Sunday. It's cool. You know, breaking even isn't a bad deal either, people out there. If you want a winner, we're talking the over 51 in the Cowboys at the Patriots.